An East Honolulu Senate race will pit veteran lawmaker Fred Hemings against the daughter of a fellow Republican. But Laura Thielen is a Democrat, making her first run for a key office. KITV 4's Catherine Cruz takes a closer look at the race of two strong candidates for a critical seat at the legislature. Former state senator Fred Hemings retired from his Capitol job two years ago, but he now wants back in. Standing in his way is Laura Thielen. The former state land director under Governor Linda Lingle decided to get off the sidelines and jump into the Senate race after watching the creation of the Public Land Development Corporation. That's a very short-term approach to raising revenue, and it hurts communities and our, our natural resources. Our cameras caught up with Thielen, who's been putting down roots as a small farmer at a Waimanalo nursery, checking out plants for an upcoming community, Makahiki. She worries about the PLDC structure, which could exempt development of state land from zoning and other reviews. Here in Waimanalo, we have a lot of agricultural lands, much of it's owned by the state. Um, under Act 55, the Public Land Development Corporation could put a resort back here, a golf course back here, uh, you know, a high rise back here, whatever it wanted. And, you know, I think that law needs to be changed or repealed. Hemings, a former world champion surfer and sports businessman, wasn't around when the legislature created the entity this past session. He too opposes the PLDC and thinks the state ought to follow the law. I'd like to be say that I'm very much an environmentalist and a conservationist. Uh. Both candidates are against the steel on steel rail project, but it's on spending and taxes that Hemings believes is what sets them apart. But Thielen, an attorney, points to her school board and land board experience as helping her with a deeper understanding of budgets than most lawmakers. More than anything, Hemings believes the legislature needs more Republicans for a more healthy political system, which has long been dominated by Democrats. We do need the checks and balances of a two-party system, and we do need voices that will bring up the problems with a monopoly government, and, and I, I want to be one of those voices. Hemming says he's been loyal to his party, compared to his opponent, who some Democrats fought to keep from running on their ticket. Thielen says she supports Democrat Party principles. She considers her recent history working with the Republican administration as bipartisan. Bipartisanship means working with the other party, not for it. And there's a big difference. Voters have the choice of two candidates, both who believe their time in government service isn't over yet. At the state capitol, Catherine Cruz, KITV4 News. You can download the KITV election app for free for your iPhone or Android. Just search the App Store for Commitment 2012.